Construction question five, question five A. This is twenty twenty five mathematics paper two GCE. This is question five A, and the question reads: Construct triangle ABC in which AB is ten centimeters. Okay, ten centimeters. That's all. So since this is the first instruction here, and it is the the base. So what you need to do is you need the, a ruler just to measure the base as 10 centimeters so this is um, where we are going to construct it from okay but in the exam they no longer give uh, answer booklets or uh, plain papers you just see answer it on the space provided answer, um, uh, space provided so it is 10 centimeters am i right Yes. Yes. So, so it's not from one, but from this point zero, right? from zero up to ten, up to ten. So up to ten is here, okay, like this, right? Then indicate this is what a, this is a what, a b, and it's ten, ten centimeters. Okay. What's the next instru instruction? The next instruction is saying a c is. E, Eight centimeters. AC is what? Eight centimeters. AC is eight centimeters. Doesn't mean that you use your ruler and your pencil and measure eight centimeters somewhere. Now this is where the compass comes to play. Are we together? Yes. Uh huh. So you measure eight centimeters. So from this point up to here, this is eight centimeters. Okay. Eight centimeters. Since it's the thing is AC. So we're going to put our compass at what? At AI. Yes. Then you're going to strike an arc this side. Okay? Like this side. Okay? Like this. And this is Z. Nice. That's all. Then you go to the next instru instruction. instruction. The next instruction is saying, and angle BAC is 100 degree degrees. B, A, C somewhere here. Aye? Okay, you should know that if anywhere in this line is eight centimeters from what? From this point, eh? Okay. Now we're going to use a protractor, a protractor for what? For angle. So we're going to put this protractor at A. At what? At A. Make sure it's at A here. Okay. All right. So we are measuring how many degrees? 100 degrees so now on which side is our line right hand side eh? yes so we're going to start from zero on our right hand side so we're going to use the inner uh, readings these are eh? so zero to 100 100 is here where is 80 on top here eh? so we're, going to, we're just going to put a mark a mark okay like that a dot then draw a straight what straight line from a passing through this point here okay doesn't mean that it end here uh -uh. it means that just pass through if we do like that you will not notice that it crosses this arc eh? the one we had drawn so this is the point what point c are we together and this is eight what eight centimeters what's the next instruction the other instruction is saying measure and write the length BC. Okay, so this is question five. Five eh? A. This is Roman number one. Then Roman number two. We want to um, Roman number two. We are, we are asked to do it to measure and write down the length B BC. Yeah? So let's measure and write down um, the length. So we measure using centimeter centimeters I so from here from this point up to this point here okay if okay so so from there this is 13 13.5 right? 0.6 0.7 0.8 right? Okay, or well, 13.7 is acceptable. Okay, 
like this use a pencil for construct for construction eh? okay so we found this one at 13.8 what? Point eight, eh? 13.8 yes 13.8 centi centimeters so you even indicate this side that this is 13.8 centimeters eh? okay so you're done constructing the triangle let's now go to the next the other question which is saying question b on your diagram draw the locus of points within triangle abc which are seven centimeters from c seven centimeters from what c don't worry if this is a single point single point eh? it's not like this one this is double point uh, uh, double a b this is a single point c so for single point measure seven centimeter mm -hmm. measure seven centi centimeters so from here up to seven here okay and you this is your paper that if you pindamu we pindamu so that c is facing you are we together yes. then you go at what at c like this okay then strike an arc just inside the tri uh, tri triangle like this eh? having done this back so that you write nice line yes. okay so this is what it looks like after drawing my own eh? so everywhere in this line it is seven centimeters eh? yes. here this side is less than seven centimeters from c okay so let's write down this is question b roman numero one like this that's how you indicate question numbers are we together yes. good then the next question is saying oh four centimeters from a b now this is double boy yes. uh-huh it's good that see it's on the same question so that i explain so you do the same you measure how many centimeters four centimeters you measure four centimeters four centimeters is here am i right okay four centimeters okay let me double check if it's correct okay. then since it's double it's a b a what is a b it means that you are going to put this uh, uh your compass at at a first eh? then draw and uh, cutting this line are we together then with the same radius don't don't temper with the measurements eh? put it at what at b do the same do the same cut this line like this okay just do like this okay then you're not done draw a line draw a what a line passing just the top part of these acts you've what you've drawn like this eh? just the top part here okay You see? Yes. This is nice. Then you, you indicate that this is question B1, B2. Okay? Yes. B2. So as I'm drawing this, there is a question that you, they usually ask at the end, which will require us to use our knowledge of what we are drawing, what we are constructing. So we should use less than, like this, this is seven centimeters from C, and this one, which is the four centimeters from a b okay do you have another instruction here yes eh? b3 equidistant from a c and b c this is double da a c and b c since it's double here what is common c, c. c is common eh? so what you do don't be on pressure don't be on pressure just to get your camper get your compass here then um go at c the common point eh? the point which is the common um common so uh, just uh, rotate this is your paper and it's your, your exam hi right. yes. open less than half that's less than half hi right? don't go on pressure just less than half don't even measure let's know that this is less than half 
strike an arc cutting the two side two lines i like this but don't temper after cutting i then put it here okay then um, strike an arc inside inside like this then lift it and put it on the other side as well as well why okay here okay this side then strike an arc inside now you notice that the two lie uh, two um arcs cross each other right? now you draw a straight line from c passing through that point that point okay so from c passing through this point here so this is the line okay after that you can um rotate your paper your paper and indicate the question now this is b3 like this this is neat okay b3 now for your own information do you know that um let's start with the first arc that we've drawn eh? the locus of point this one this line here this side is less than seven centimeters this side is greater than seven centimeters do you know that yes, yes okay and do you know that this line this side is less than four centimeters and this side is greater than four centimeters yes. good now do you know that this line here this side is near to ac this side is near to bc this line okay see this is the equidistance right yes is cutting this triangle into two parts two parts right okay into two parts this side is nearer to what b a c this side is b b c we have the last question here right? and the same question c a point within triangle a b c is such that it is less than or equal to seven centimeters from c less than or equal to less c so our answer should be this side this side are we together yes. okay number one the other information is that it is less than or equal to four, less than or equal to four centimeters from a b less what this line i so it's down here so it can either be this side of this side eh? so what will help us is the equid equidistance so it's saying it is nearer to a c than b c nearer to a c than b c it is nearer to a c this side eh? than this side so it's this one i eh? and they're saying indicate by shading the region in which p must lie must lie so we are going to indicate by shading this one i p right so we are going to shade we are shading this part am i right okay and that's it and this looks neat